I, uh, I thought I'd take a break from the usual mundane stuff and just show you something um, a little bit tricky that you can do with the um, cross section. So I'm going to insert uh, a cross section here. I'm going to select all of those nodes now by clicking and dragging lasso. And I'm going to turn on the terrain snap. Now just before I do, I'll show you what terrain snap does, just in case you haven't watched uh, one of the other videos that does show it. If I've got terrain that's out here, bulging up. If I turn that terrain snap off um, for that cross section, so if I just go back here and set it to zero for all of the points that I've got selected there, um, put it to zero, um, you see that the, the road there is snapping to the to the road, to the cross section. So in the, the point here of this track is, is um, sticking to what this cross section is saying, and we slightly merge with the other cross section down the end of the road here. Um, so now what I'm going to do is something interesting. I'll turn that onto a hundred percent, and now we see that cross section and the points near it. I'm just going to move that cross section to there by holding the M key and just clicking on my track. Now I'll hold the C key and just copy that cross section there. So every point in between here is 100% um, done um, determined by the terrain underneath. So now you can switch back to your terrain editor and um, just edit the road if you like. You're actually editing the terrain but uh, the road follows it 100% so um, if you wanted to change the, the material there oops, use the same icon. I'm going to hit control here and select a, a new, add a new material section and control there. So um, there's a whole section of material here now and I'm going to click on that and change the panel size to be smaller, say one. And you see now for, for that whole section that I've done, um, the whole area is more detailed. It has um, you know, these panel spacings are, are one meter apart. Let's, let's just change it even more to point uh, seven five, so it's even more detailed. Um, and uh, switching back to the terrain, switching back to there, you can then uh, come back here and, and put a bit more detail into that road if you wanted to, without having to use any more cross sections. Yeah. And it sort of looks very natural with the, the terrain, because the terrain is, is the road. Um, so it's sort of, it really blends in really well. I um, thought that was a cool little tip on uh, one of the tricks that you can do. Thanks again for watching.